is up you guys welcome back to my channel and we are starting the summer in the city series I am so excited you guys it is Wednesday morning and starting today for two weeks I am vlogging every day um, it's not vlogmas I'm not vlogging every day until Christmas for you um, it is just two weeks in the city I live in New York City if you guys are new here hey what's up my name is Danielle Moved here in August. This is my first like true summer in New York City. And there are so many amazing fun activities that I've been wanting to try here. And I feel like it would be so fun if I take you guys along. Like I have literally a whole long list. And I have a ton of friends here in the city that want to join me on certain days. So there's going to be a lot of little cameos of some of my friends that live here doing stuff with me. Not every day is going to be super exciting. There's going to be days where I'm not like doing an exciting touristy thing or like an exciting thing in New York. But for the most part, I'm just trying to like try new things and a little something every day. And it's just a way for me to vlog every day for you guys. So hope you guys like the intro. My intro was made by Gabby Whiten. She's amazing. Her Instagram is gabbywhiten.creative. Um, and then her regular Instagram is Gabby Whiten. She crushed it. She did my Vlogmas intro too. Um, and I think it just encapsulates everything. So today's about to be a very exciting day. I want to give you guys the rundown, but I kind of need to go. We're starting off the day with a workout. I train with Jane Simmons. She's absolutely incredible. I work out with her three times a week. So we're going to head to do that now. And then I'll take you guys along the rest of the day. I'm so excited. I can't believe I'm vlogging every day. I am so excited because I know how excited. Like when I posted this on Instagram, you guys were like, oh my God. So. Follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn, because you would have known this ahead of time. Here's the workout outfit for the day. I'm obsessed with Story Apparel right now. It's Story with an I. It's from there. It's this fun pink set. It's summertime. I love it. I just have my hair in a little orange claw clip for now. I like to work out in claw clips because sometimes she'll have me like lay down. If you have a ponytail, it kind of hurts. So I can just take the claw clip out, put it back in, you know. Um, put on my super goop glow screen because it's sunny out there and then my shoes are Adidas I literally got them on Amazon so who knew they sold Adidas on Amazon I mean I knew but like I didn't know they sold sneakers anyways besides point I'm obsessed with Topo Chico's right now like I'm in my Topo Chico era so I'm drinking one of these right now I'm probably gonna drink it on my walk we're gonna head over to the gym put in my airpods listen to some good music get the day started I did start my period yesterday it is day two. If you know, you know. It's the worst day. It was so hard to get out of bed this morning, but now that I'm up, I am ready. All right, bring in the tote bag. Uh, I might show you guys what's in my tote bag later. I feel like that would be fun because there's all kinds of fun little stuff in here. Sunglasses, check. I love my workouts because it's also like I get a little hot girl walk in, even though we are doing a bigger hot girl walk later with my friend Jazz in a cool area. I will link my Ray-Bans down below. I just got them and I'm really obsessed with the style. AirPod cases from the Daily Edited. Popping these bad boys in. I'm like squatting right now and I'm not even at my workout yet. Anyways, I'm running late. Let's go get a, get a pump in. <laughs> okay, welcome back guys. is done it was got me where I needed to be and now um, I thought it'd be fun to start off the summer in the city series by having you guys join me on my table for one club um, something I started kind of like on TikTok, on Instagram eating at restaurants alone should be normalized and that's what I'm about to do um, I purposely like just had like a little like half of a bagel today because I want to have a whole little breakfast to myself, sit alone at a restaurant. It's very, very empowering. Um, table for one club. So I'm going to check out Two Hands over here on Bleecker and get a quick breakfast and then we'll get on with the day. But I hope this inspires you guys to, sometimes the best date is yourself. And if you want to go to a restaurant, why, if you don't have a friend, why can't you still go? You should still go.
fabulous. The waiter or waitress will always treat you so well. They're so kind. You just feel so luxe and amazing. One thing that one of you um, DM'd me and brought attention to, which I wanted to shout out, when you're table for one, obviously you're sitting at a table for two typically, so the waiter is making a little bit less money based off the tip because it's just one person. So what this girl does is she says she will tip to like 25 to 35% of the bill rather than like 15 to 20 just so the waiter like because she like worked in the service industry um you know can still get the proper tip so that's what i did today so i just want to shout that out um and just bring that to your attention if you're feeling generous that day because it will put a smile on their face and that's like the money they would be making if there was a table for two i stopped at whole foods on my walk back I was in desperate need of a grocery run, hence why I honestly went to get food this morning because I had nothing in my um, fridge because I was away for two weeks and I've just been putting off grocery shopping. Uh, so I'll do a little Whole Foods haul for you guys. A lot of times I'll do Instacart and get it from Wegmans because they have like name brand stuff and stuff you know um, and it's just so fast. Like if I do Instacart in the morning, I'll get my stuff within a few hours. Like it's insane, like they deliver. But I love Whole Foods so much, I love walking around and seeing what they have to offer. So, we got some fun stuff from Whole Foods today. Got more sourdough bread. This brand, bread alone, is really tasty sourdough bread. I got some yogurt. I wanna get back onto making my yogurt parfaits in the morning. Fresh mozzarella. Oh my gosh, I'm having a moment with gem lettuce and baby butter lettuce. So I got that. Because I've been using salad dressing, you guys. Only one kind, and I'll shout it out in a second. Purely Elizabeth granola is my favorite. It is so tasty with um, your yogurt and berries. This is my favorite. I was just attracted to these. These are little breakfast slices of ham for my breakfast. I got chicken tenderloins because they're a lot easier to cook. I'll just do that with like rice and broccoli. I got microgreens because these are so good for you and just so easy to throw on so many different meals with your eggs in the morning, whatever you want. And then I got arugula. So basically I got the mozzarella, the arugula, and then I got like cherry tomatoes or grape tomatoes. But I don't even know the difference between cherry and grape tomatoes. Can you guys tell me? With Italian dressing, it's like the only salad dressing I like. And like a light vinaigrette, like a balsamic vinaigrette I like. Um, that's just been such a great lunch for me or dinner. Got some broccoli florets, some berries. I got blackberries, raspberries. These are either cherry or grape tomatoes. I cannot remember. Having a moment with cantaloupe these days. I just always like to have a thing of pasta sauce on hand. Gotta take a sip of my topo. Nothing like a walk back and just popping open a fresh cold thing of topo. Trying this classic Italian dressing. It's just so light and refreshing. And then I just got one kombucha because they're so heavy. Baby carrots for snacking, for fireball. If you know, you know. Getting two of these Vive ginger shots just to have on hand. I need to like make some of my own again. Or like, I don't even know. I just need to get back on it. But I just got two to have in my fridge. I got tulips. I don't know why I continue to get tulips and they just go awry. Even if I poke holes and put pennies in the vase, they just... But I just am obsessed with them. So I got more tulips. Gotta have some flowers in a vase, you know? It's summer in the city. I got lots of produce. I got grapes, a great summer snack. If I do a picnic this week or something, I thought it'd be fun to bring some grapes. Bananas, such a great little snack as well. Two avocados. I love having avocado and egg in the morning. So good. And then I also got berries for that yogurt parfait I was speaking of. I got two white peaches because they were just calling my name and they, they just seem like they're gonna be really tasty. And then I got two Fuji apples. And that is apples to apples. <laughs> It was actually a pretty big Whole Foods haul. I wish I brought my tote bags with me. I just didn't think about going, so I used these. But we will recycle these. Yeah, I'm gonna put all of this away now. My head was hurting a little bit. Whenever my head hurts, I put on this Charlotte Tilbury mask. I keep it in the freezer and it has these like acupressure points. And I swear, I just keep it on for like five minutes because honestly, it loses its cold pretty fast. And my, my headache is a lot more relieved, so. Fun fact, these little acupressure points are doing what they need to do. I've just been sitting on my couch unwinding for a little bit. I definitely went to bed too late last night and woke up for the gym and everything. I think my body's just like a little tired, so I'm just taking a little break. My shoes are off, as you can tell. It's ice rolling. 
you know, shake my claw clip out. I was literally just like laying here. I don't, I need to lay more. I need to nap more. But anyways, besides the point, I am going to make some hot tea, which I know is weird because it's summer, but it's really cold in my apartment, which I'm happy about. And I'm just kind of feeling, I don't know, like a little weird. And sometimes when I drink some hot tea, it kind of just like brings me back to center. I've been having a great day, but all of a sudden I was just like, ooh, I feel a little funky. And when I drink a hot tea, it just kind of makes me feel a little less anxious, a little, just a little more centered. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. I really don't know how to explain it. It just feels kind of like a warm hug when I drink hot tea. It doesn't like cure my anxiety or anything, but it just really grounds me. Just need to do a couple emails and then relax a little bit. And then in about 45 minutes, my friend Jazz and I are gonna do a hot girl walk. We live near each other and we always are like, we should hot girl walk together. And it's perfect because I'm starting my Summer in the City series and I've actually never been to Battery Park in New York and I heard it's really, really great in the summertime. I really don't even know how to describe it because I've never been, so I'm gonna take you guys along. Um, so we're gonna start at Battery Park and then walk down West Side Highway, which is one of the spots that I wanted to show you guys in Summer of the City series. It's such a great walk along the Hudson River. There's tons of piers with things to do. So many people, so many hot people, honestly, like always walk I'm like, where am I? Um, and it's a beautiful day. So we're gonna start the um, walk at Battery Park um, and then walk down the West Side Highway. And I'm excited to catch up with her and walk there and it'll just be so fun. All right, we're about to go downstairs. I'm gonna meet Jazz, and we're gonna Uber to Bryant, Bryant Park, Battery Park, because it's pretty far from us, and I have a call at four. We're kind of squeezing this in, because she had calls till two, and I have a call at four, so we're just like doing this. So we're Ubering to Battery Park, and then we're gonna walk down. So I'm so excited. I've, I've like been near Battery Park, but I've never like walked through it and like seen what it's all about. I know it's on the water, which you guys know I love. I was just reapplying my super goop glow screen. Now it's all over my hands. Um, but I love this stuff so much. It just gives you a nice little glow. I'm gonna put a little perfume on, Malin and Goetz, vetiver. Cause I haven't showered from the gym yet because I just felt like, why would I do that? Because I'm literally going for a walk. So this is the fit. Uber's almost here. Using my Gals in the Go tote because I just want to be able to put my camera in here and my kombucha. I've been doing this a lot with my hair lately. It's kind of a vibe. It kind of looks sloppy, but I kind of don't mind it. Anyways, I'm gonna go meet Jazz. Let's go for a walk. All right, we made it to Battery Park. I'm here with Jazz. She's wearing green and I'm wearing pink. A little uh, Cosmo and Wanda, you ain't slick situation. Never been, neither has Jazz, so we're... Discovering. Discovering is the word. We're taking it all in. This is actually beautiful though, from what I'm seeing. The water's right there. Oh, we should go on a boat soon. That looks nice. See those yes. people? Little little boat moment. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. People are sitting, enjoying. Okay, I'll stop narrating now. Yes, we're also gonna jet ski. We just decided on the Hudson River. I think that'd be fun. There's Statue of Liberty. Hey girl, what's up? Wow, I feel like I'm in like Newport, Rhode Island or something like with this. <laughs> so pretty and Freedom Tower. Oh, Jazz goes, I feel like I'm not even New York City. And then like Statue of Liberty is right there. Other than that though, I really don't think I'm in New York. I'm at a country club. Right? This is so interesting. Nice day. It's a, there's like barely a cloud in the sky. This little area, like someone should propose to someone here. I just see that for them. Well, with Jersey in the background. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Oh, and there's like a little thing. I don't really know what that those stairs are they don't really go to anywhere but I'm here for it oh maybe just like a meeting oh, oh. <laughs> that's so funny I love hearing the waves crash too very very peaceful so I guess this will just keep continuing us down West Side Highway this is great I should have put on some sunscreen I feel like I'm getting a little sun <laughs> Guys, I highly suggest this walk. Now we're approaching Brookfield Place, which you guys know I come here a lot. There's like sailboats, they're setting up for a concert, so you can't really see it. Some restaurants, this would be really pretty at sunset. There's a really great food court inside, um, and stores, they have like Gucci and Bottega and that kind of vibe. Um, and some like more cheaper stores as well. This is so cute and summery. If this wasn't here, it'd be even better. 
so you can see like the sailboats and stuff. And then you just keep walking down West Side Highway. This is fabulous. This is a fabulous walk. I'm very happy with it. Lots to see, you know? Lots to see. Lots to see. Just got back from the walk. It was so amazing. I'm gonna do that walk a lot more, especially during the summer, I highly suggest it. Like I said, we started in Battery Park and then just kept walking. You just come across so many amazing things like Brookfield Place, the West Side Highway, all the piers, like such a vibe. I'm actually going back there for dinner tonight, which one is, is one of the other things I'm gonna do in my little series. So getting a lot in today. Um, I'm about to hop on a call with my manager for something exciting, something exciting that we're working on that won't be available for a very long time, but I'm very on brand and something you guys will be very excited about. Um, but I just had a messenger come to my door and he delivered me my guff ball tickets from Super Goop because I'm going to guff ball this weekend with Super Goop. I can't go Saturday because I have plans on the Jersey Shore. I'm so excited. I'm going to my friend Daly's for her birthday and we're going to this place called Parker House, which is apparently like a house, but it's like a, like a bar. Oh my god, this is so cute. Oh my god. Okay, maybe, okay, so this is not the tickets. The tickets are coming tomorrow, but they sent me this. Wait, oh my god, this is adorable. All I'm saying, you guys, is it is a super goop summer. Oh my god, they put the resetting spray in here. And then what else? The lip shear screen. Oh, it is my bands. We got two bands. Ryan's gonna come with me. We're definitely going Friday night to go ball because Lewis the Child's there, Lil Wayne. I think Lil Wayne, um, who else? Migos, Kid Cudi, Jack Harlow. It's gonna be a fun night. And then Saturday, Sally won't be able to go. I mean, I guess Ryan could go. And then Sunday night is J. Cole. So we might go just for J. Cole. Oh, more glow screen. I am, this is so freaking cute. I wonder if I can bring this to God Box. I think Brooke was saying they have like a clear bag policy. I wonder if this would like count. The fact that I could just put my resetting spray in here you just like spray it, it's like spray sunscreen for your face, I gather. Shut up, this is so, I love Super Goop. Super Goop Summer, you heard it here first. Okay, I'm gonna get on this call. All right, you guys, so it's a little bit later now. I just like sleeked back my hair, I put on, I just tried the Glow Screen Golden Hour because it has a little bit more tint to it. It's lit. It's lit. Okay, I need to blend on the sides there. Okay, we're seeing it in the sunlight. Um, and I tried this Clarins lip oil too. Um, can't decide if I like them yet. But Kelly's here. Hey. She's doing makeup. Per usual. <laughs> per usual. Concealing my pumps. <laughs> She's concealing, and we're about to go to dinner. One of the places I've been really, really wanting to try it. Always walk past it. It's called City Vineyard, and um, it's on West Side Highway. I literally passed it today. It looks so nice to be there at sunset time, which is when we're going. Good vibes. And Kelly, when she walked in the door, she brought us wine. Into which was go just cups. into go cups. She was prepared. She was like, I come bearing gifts. Mm -hmm. So we're having a little pregame. That yeah, we were both feeling it's that type of day. And we're both in our little black dresses, little casual dresses, no makeup day. It's funny, we're all texting the group chat, like, okay, like what are the vibes? Like no what makeup. are we wearing? Like no okay, one's great. getting done up. No one's getting done up. Um, we're meeting Margot Washery and Shannon Ford. We're just gonna a little chill girls din. Early night uh -huh. for the gals. We have glow screen on. Glow, glow screen. screen, brows, and lip. That's all you oh, yeah. need. Gym lip. Gym lip. Okay guys, here's my little dress. It's from Free People. It has pockets. It's you, so comfy. You went into that. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry, I forgot. You You'll get used to it. I just gotta pop in and out. <laughs> Bag is from Viverall. It's a Chanel bag. I don't even. Yeah, I think I showed you guys last night. I'm obsessed with it. It's so cute because it's a bag that like I wouldn't buy, but I would rent for the summer. So, yeah. And I'm just wearing sneakers. Here's Kelly's fit. She's looking chic as ever. Meshki dress. Meshki dress Primark that I'm going to buy. Size. I need a pedicure. Don't zoom in on my No feet pics here. These are the new. They're actually a little too big for my face, but these are the new um, Valaria she created. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I saw your stories. Yeah, she created her sunglass line. I have a small face though, but they're really cute. They look so sick on you. Your hair looks amazing. Did you crimp it? I did. I did looks beautiful. Like Love it. Crazy girl here. Yay! We're off to City Vineyard, Illy. All right, we are approaching yes. City Vineyard. It's just like a beautiful afternoon, evening, should I say now? I don't know if anyone's here yet. Ugh, oh, I just love it. I hope we get to sit up there. All right, 
I got the pizza. Oh, you all got salads again? No, I got Oh, okay, okay, thank goodness. <laughs> Hi, guys. Mags is here. Hi, baby. Hi. Say hello to the. Oh, She just smells my pizza, but I'll just pretend that she loves me. It's fine. It's dark out now. We love it. Just got back from dinner. It was so much fun. Such a great little group dynamic the four of us were tonight. Shannon's freaking hilarious like and Margo always just like tells me how it needs to be and Kelly's just the kindest most amazing person ever So it's just like a really good group and city vineyard was so nice. It's not to be confused with city winery City winery is like an event space. I think maybe you can eat there too But we went to city vineyard and it was just so nice. It was right by the water sunset so 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 nice and I'm just so happy we did it was a really good vibe. Everyone was in a really good mood. We got a cheese board uh, I forgot to film that, but highly suggest, obviously, mainly in the summer. Um, I just got a package in the mail from Revolve, my recent order, and I feel like I want to do a little try-on right now. It's literally 10 o'clock, but I got a little wine in me. There's some really fun summer pieces, and I'm going to be wearing all this stuff in the next few days, so I figured I'll just do a little try-on haul. I was going to just hold everything up for you guys. I was like, no. The Dan fam deserves a try-on haul, so we're going to do that. Let's do it. Okay. Here is item number one. This dress, imagine it with nude heels. So cute, it's just a cute little tube dress. So flattering, it's obviously from Revolve. I'll link this below, I'll link everything below that I'm talking about. Such a great summer dress if you're going to a wedding. I feel like this is cute. I'm going to a movie premiere next week. Or not movie premiere, sorry, series premiere. Hint, hint. And it's like a red carpet, but I feel like it's gonna be more, like I feel like I could wear this. But like you could also like wear this with sneakers. I don't know. It's just like a really, really comfortable material. I love how it hugs the hips. It's very flattering. It's from the brand all the ways. So highly suggest. This is, I'm very happy with this. Oh my gosh. Another amazing summer midi dress. Okay, this also could be worn at the premiere. You guys know I love this color so much. I love this. So it's kind of like a corset top up here. The lighting is also not ideal. I should have done this earlier, but you know, we're here now. So it's like corset up here and then it, the dress like ends here, but then it has all of this like extra fabric, fab, fabric, fabric that is like ruched kind of. And it does this little asymmetrical moment again with some nude heels. Oh, this is so cute. So flattering. I'm guess I'm having a strapless moment, but this is like, I, this is not going to fall down. Like it feels very secure. This is beautiful, and I love that it's a little bit longer because it's not as like clubby, you know? Sheevka, sheesh, I like this a lot. Another amazing summer dress. I am hitting the jackpot. Oh my gosh, as you guys can tell, I love midi dresses. This is so freaking cute. I love the cutout. This is stunning. I'm really like not giving a lot for you guys right now because I feel like the dress just like says everything for itself. Ah, this is so great. I don't have a place to wear it yet, but I can't wait. This is great for like vacation, like a little beachy dinner, but you could also make it chic. It's giving more beachy for me, but it's summer. So I feel like that's what we want. Link below. So cute. This set is so cute. One of the things about living alone, I can't tie this in the back right now and I just don't feel like it. This color. Oh my gosh. So yeah, this is the set. They come separately but I love them. You can wear them individually. I just think as a set, this is so cute. This like beautiful blue color. It reminds me of Essie Bikini Sotini. You guys know that color. And this would obviously look way more fitted if I were able to tie this in the back. I probably could, I'm just a little lazy right now. But this is so cute. For summer, again, with heels. I'm just in a heels mood, aren't I? Ah, ah. I'm really like feeling all these, huh? Oh my God, my under boob, sorry. Another really cute set revolve crushing it. I was really worried that this top wouldn't fit well it totally is I'm wearing a size small. Oh My god, this is so cute like just on its own too with like another skirt would be Fabulous. This is so great. I love this. I just love everything about this I love like it's a little bit more structured right here, which is cool. Then this is the little skirt I'm obsessed. I'm sorry. I'm like being really bad at describing tonight, but I just feel like the theme is cute, the theme is summer, and this is just another great summer set. This dress, so gorgeous. I love it. I didn't even realize online that it had this little slit, which just makes it, I mean, obviously it's such a feminine dress, but it just makes it even more 
I cannot wait to wear this throughout the summer. I'd probably wear this with my hair down, so don't mind my hair being up right now. I feel like it needs hair down. This is just stunning. I love it. It's like a light pink color. It's giving like a little love shack fancy vibe. So cute. The off the shoulder sleeves. There's, there's definitely like a lot going on, but I'm really here for it. <laughs> okay, I'm covering because I'm wearing dark underwear and it was just dumb for this try on. This set is so cute. A moment of silence for it as I cover my green undies. It's a little midi skirt situation with the top. I love it. Neon, it literally matches my nails. We love. Oh my god. Oh my god, you scared me. Brian, I'm filming. Good to see you, you look great. I oh, thank you. And then lastly, I got these shoes because I thought they'd be some fun summer shoes. They're from the brand Ray, the label. I just love this. I love this set. Just need to wear some different undies. It's just perfect, right? <laughs> He's like, what is happening? Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I know. But um, yeah, that's the try on haul. Hope you guys enjoyed. All right, you guys. I'm so, so sleepy. I think it's a mixture of wine and working out and long walks and lots of socializing. Just a great day. A great day. Fun in the sun. I really hope you guys enjoyed day one of my Summer in the City series. Please make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you're notified every single day when I post a new one of these. Um, again, I'll be doing two weeks from like today and 13 more days. <laughs> um, and yeah, I'm just excited. I have some really fun stuff planned. Tomorrow's going to be an amazing, amazing day. I can't wait to take you guys along. I'm doing something that I've never done in the city before that I'm really excited to experience. And that's that on that. I'm going to wash my face, upload this, or import this footage, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for our next video. Good night, guys. Get some sleep. See you later.